we introduce you to actress Eve Plum, better known as Jan Brady on the Brady Bunch. We're so excited you're here. I noticed your shirt standing in solidarity with those who are striking right now on the picket lines between the writers and actors, though we hope, fingers crossed, that the writers are coming up with a deal very soon. But Eve, what made you decide to auction off? What, say that again? I think everybody wants to get back to work. Yes. Yeah. Oh, definitely. Uh, everybody does want to go back to work. But Eve, what made you decide to auction off some of those iconic collectibles from your job as a little kid? Well, I have been holding on to all this stuff for a really long time. And as you know, as you, as you, as you live longer, you just accumulate more things. And they were all very precious to me. But I decided it was time that somebody else should be able to enjoy them. And I really wanted to do it now uh, while I had the well, I had the time and, and opportunity to do it. Yeah, and I was reading, you know, some of the, the items up for auction. You've got a pilot teleplay signed by you when it was called the Brady Brood instead of, you know, the Brady wow. Brunt Bunch. Uh, a wristwatch, headshots. Is some of that hard to part with? And, and do you have a favorite item? There are a lot of uh, personal things here, but when I really started going through it, I was amazed at all of the different things I have. Uh, the things from, from personal things like Needlepoint to the animation self of the Brady Kids cartoon, um, even down into my little beach chair that I had as a kid that I would sit in in Laguna Beach that always made me feel like a grown-up because I had a chair that was my size. <laughs> when you think about all of the pieces that tell a story uh, behind the scenes, what would you say your story was, the backstory to uh, the uh, <laughs> script of the Brady Bunch? Well, that it was a really interesting, fun time. I had already been working for about four years when I got the Brady Bunch, so I was already used to working on sets. But this was sort of a really special time. It it all gelled. It all worked together. Uh, we I learned how to be an actor from uh, Robert Reed and Ambie Davis and Florence Henderson. I learned how to how to how to be an actor. Yeah, and I also know that one of the items up is a signed Screen Actors Guild contract that you had from 1967, uh, which is is fitting uh, uh, right now and relevant. What was your most memorable episode that you taped on the Brady Bunch? Do you mind sharing that or, or a favorite memory of sorts? Um, I mean, it was. I think that it was unique that we got to go to school on the set and be with our wonderful teacher, Francis Whitfield. Um, that was a unique way to learn and to, to sort of grow up on the Paramount lot uh, was really exciting. We would go to lunch on the other side, which was the Desilu side, which had been RKO. So growing up around Hollywood history was really what was fun for me. We have only seconds to go. The most important question besides where to get the auction items. Will you be supporting Barry Williams tonight on Dancing with the Stars? <laughs> Oh, go, Barry. I think it's perfect that he's on Dancing with the Stars, and I'm really pulling for him. Your big brother. All right, Eve Plum, it's an honor to have you here. Thank you so much uh, for coming on and, and talking about this yes. beautiful auction. Uh, anybody watching, you can log on right now. Go to Julian's Auctions, uh, and Eve Plum's Jan Brady and Career Archives is available for you to start bidding on Monday, starting at 11 a.m. Pacific time. Thanks again, so Eve. Oh, cool. Yes, thank you. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.